Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Sport Calgary's member profile videos. This is Becca Gould of Sport Calgary and we are here at the Calgary Lawn Bowling Club and we're here to talk about the Pride Lawn Bowling League. What is the Pride Lawn Bowling League? Calgary's Pride Lawn Bowling League started out in 2003 with the premise of making lawn bowling safe regardless of sexual orientation or identity. It's basically just to make people have a good time and come out and be social. Let's talk about the program that Pride Lawn Bowling offers, which is the league itself. How often does that night happen? If it's Tuesday, we're here bowling from usually June to the end of August. We start at 6, we do food and beverages. At 6.30 we do Bulls Challenge, which changes each week. And then we go through the sport at 7 o'clock and that's two 5N games that we play. It's available for people ages 18 plus. Let's talk about the sport of lawn bowling. What is the object of the game? So the object of the game is to get the bowl to the jack. So we know the object of the game in lawn bowling is to bowl the bowl and get to the jack as close as possible. Can you explain to people that may not have heard of lawn bowling or don't know the game of lawn bowling, what the jack is and what a bowl is? So the jack is the little white ball that is the target for lawn bowling. And this is the bowl. The reason that it's the bowl is because there's a little white circle and the big circle here. This has got the bias on it and it actually curves as it goes down the field. And that's why it's actually called a bowl instead of a ball. So that way people can get more spin or orient the ball to go in a certain direction that it wants to go in. Yes. So the number of bowls you get is dependent on how many people or how many teams there are. Yes, singles is four bowls where the triples and the doubles can either bowl two or three dependent on what is agreed upon before the game starts. If you're doing four, then it's two bowls. How many ends are usually in a game of lawn bowling? The ends of lawn bowling can go from one to many. It, it just depends on what is agreed upon at the start of the game. For Pride Lawn Bowling, we do five end games. What are some misconceptions or challenges that you have faced when you're explaining the sport to other people? So one of the misconceptions is that people think that it's more like bocce ball. A bocce ball is round, where a lawn bowl is not round at all. The thing is, it's more like curling than it is like uh, bocce ball, where bocce ball is played on a long grass surface that you can do at campgrounds, things like that, where in lawn bowling, it's all on a turf. How did you get involved with the Pride Lawn Bowling League? So I got involved with the Pride Lawn Bowling League because one of the guys couldn't take over anymore. So I make sure that everything is running smoothly. I basically view myself as a liaison between the Calgary Lawn Bowling Club and Pride Lawn Bowling. And it's all volunteer based. Yeah, absolutely. Everybody that helps with us is all volunteers. That is really cool to hear knowing that volunteers are super involved in the sport of lawn bowling. Yeah. That's awesome. If there are Calgarians out there that are interested in getting involved with Pride Lawn Bowling, how can they get in contact with the club? They can get in contact with us through our Facebook page, which is Pride Lawn Bowling. They can get a hold of us through our website at pridelawnbowling.com or they can always email us at members at pridelawnbowling.com. Why should people try out the sport of lawn bowling? Lawn bowling itself is a very social game where people come out and enjoy a time out. It's not as physical as other sports, but it offers a great social aspect to sports. So especially if you don't have that ability to do the physical aspects of other sports, lawn bowling is a great way of getting outdoors and socializing without having to put your body at risk. Absolutely, we have all kinds of abilities to play the actual sport. It's a very inclusive sport that a lot of people can play regardless of who you are. Absolutely. 